On this trip, I learned that humans are not meant to be alone. I had this realization with a friend and teacher of mine on Wednesday's beach walk. As I observed the snowy plovers flying in unison, I found it fascinating that they never once ran into each other. I vocalized my wonder to my friend, and we talked about it for a while. We talked until we arrived at a question. Would the birds be quite so fascinating if they were alone? I realized that they wouldn't be. The beauty of their synchronization came from the group, not the individual. Then I reflected on this lesson and applied it to my own life. I'm a solitary person, and most of my achievements are my own. In order to observe teamwork or synchrony, which are necessary to human existence, there must be a team or group to observe in the first place. Humans have forever lived together, and only since the principle of personal possessions and individual living spaces have we separated. Individual achievements are now more celebrated than group accomplishments, even though groups generally make more change and do more than an individual could on their own.